And I'm Dudley. Welcome to the show. Welcome. Happy Mother's Day. Happy to Mother's the, all your Day. mothers out there. <laughs> you mothers. You mothers. <laughs> uh, <sighs> yep, Mother's Day. Yes. We have the best mothers. Yes. Mother. So, sorry. So we have the best mother. The rest of we you have all a single mother. Have led a unfulfilled life. Oh yeah, you not you known you the best mother. A good mother. The I, best. I, there's just no no comparison. I mean, pure yours was fine. It's just whatever. Uh, whoever she was, ours was is, is the best. Ours is the best. Or I got her a little Groot pot. Mm-hmm. Like you got her pot? No, oh, no, I got her. You know, it's a little. Groot. I'm not familiar with this pot called Groot. <laughs> It's a, is this a it, new strain? It's it, it Groot from the Guardians of the uh-huh. Galaxy. Uh, I'm aware. Or, I'm... or Infinity Wars, the more mm. recent film. Uh-huh. Uh, it's, it's Groot, like mm. a little propped up on his mm. yeah. like, hand. Groot, with you can put a pot, a small little plant, desk plant in, yeah. in his head. Yeah, I bought her the plant that went in it. Oh, uh, well, that's good. Yeah. A little, little plant. Mm-hmm. A little cactus thing she got. It wasn't cactus. Yeah, it was a type of cactus. No, it's not. It didn't it, have, it it didn't have it spines. Ri- it, Therefore, it can't be a cactus. It is a. It is a cacti. cacti. Not all cactus bits. have yes, they have do. prickly yes, bits. Yes, they do. They don't. Yes, they do. Um, well, you, you don't, don't know anything. You it was mislabeled any- at where you bought it. No, it, that their whole selection was cacti. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Mm-hmm. So, yeah, I bought her a puzzle. Yeah. Yeah, a Star Wars puzzle. <laughs> <laughs> so we got some nerdy gifts. Yeah, and uh, she enjoyed all of them thoroughly. Yes. And. So, uh, happy Mother's Day to happy our mother Mother's who Day. doesn't listen to the show. That's fine. But that's okay. I mean, there's not a lot here for her. No. <laughs> no. Uh, we don't talk about Animal Crossing that much, <laughs> so she, <laughs> she she wouldn't wouldn't get much out of it. Mm-hmm. Um, but anyway. She hope. is, like, the biggest Animal Crossing play- fan. Yeah. Like, she plays the mobile version now. She played the, re- the uh, DS version way more than any of us. Yeah, for, like, two or three years. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, she played it, and up until the mobile one came mm-hmm. out, she played it a lot. She switched to it, yeah. And uh, I, I don't know how yeah. she still played it, <laughs> but she didn't. Speaking of Animal Crossing, I tried to, uh, I mentioned on the show trying to introduce my girlfriend to gaming. Uh huh. And she loved Destiny, so mm-hmm. we played that a lot. Star but, Wars uh, Destiny. Um, I got to give her a shot at uh, Animal Crossing. Yeah. Uh, and she uh, wouldn't have it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she didn't seem to, it didn't seem to hook her. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Apparently, I didn't mean to say hooker in <laughs> reference to your girlfriend. <laughs> yeah, but, I, yeah. How dare you? <laughs> how dare you? Uh, we're not past the five minute part, so she yeah. probably heard. She, this. Oh, she listens to the whole show now. Oh yeah. Oh, oh no. <laughs> oh no. Uh, I I didn't mean to call you a hooker. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm just gonna you're... just gonna lay that out there before you get angry. Uh huh. This is Dan. This she is Dudley. No, it's not. This don't, is Dudley talking don't right now. Start that. She knows. She knows <laughs> you the can't difference. Tell the difference. She knows the difference. <laughs> um, she listens to it in ten-minute increments. Oh, that's she... about as far as she can stand us. <laughs> oh, I guess. That explains why. Why when she comes over, she talks to me for about ten minutes, and then she walks out of the yeah. room. <laughs> like, yeah, that she does meet the same way. <laughs> okay, um, that's enough. Oh. <laughs> uh, she she apparently listens for like five minutes to work and then mm. five minutes back mm-hmm. or something like that. So mm. she does like ten minutes okay. a day kind of thing. And so by the end of the week, she listens to the whole episode. Okay. And there you go. And she gets the next one. Well, that's cool. Apparently she had an episode behind, though. But oh, she that's fine. She was busy. That's busy fine. with her life. Yeah. But, uh, yeah, she didn't care for... Well, she didn't get... She didn't really give it a chance. And um, I explained all the stuff to it, and she was just like, mm, no. Yeah, I, the comment I heard was it's too much like living life. Yeah, she's which like, is fair. I, I don't, I don't need to have a pretend house uh, that I pay a mortgage on <laughs> and I pay rent <laughs> once a yeah. month already. Yeah, yeah. So, I, I, she, she doesn't see the appeal of games that we, you and I tend to enjoy, mm-hmm. which are very much like work. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Yeah. <laughs> so I, I'm still on a journey to uh, figure out something uh-huh. that she would like besides uh, Star Wars Destiny. No, something she can play on her own. Yeah. Um, so, uh, so far, yeah, no good. If y'all yeah. have recommendations, yeah, we, yeah, yeah. Uh, tweet it to us, tweet it to us, or and, uh, uh, or email us, or whatever. Uh, the yeah. yeah, we have a weird fascination with games that are v- very much about living a life or yeah. doing a job, mm-hmm. 
And it's just, I don't I can understand why some people don't find that appealing. <laughs> yeah, like you know I I played Farm Simulator, yeah, Stardew Valley, Animal Crossing, Papers uh, Please, Papers Please. <laughs> that one's just depressing. <laughs> <laughs> um, uh, and, you know other yeah. you know any of the Dizactronic is basically a job. I mean they're yeah, puzzles, they're puzzles, they're puzzle games. Yeah. So there's a sense of accomplishment, yeah. and that's why I try to get her like you. you there's a sense of accomplishment when you complete yeah, a yeah, goal, I uh, and apparently that wasn't good enough. Yeah. What that, good enough. When you're trying to explain what you're supposed to get out of a game, it's probably not time to call quits on that one. Yeah. So, I don't know. She seems yeah. to enjoy playing it competitively yes. against me okay. and you. She played you a few, mm-hmm. few times, or one mm-hmm. time. She has, she's made comments about wanting to play me again in Star Wars Destiny mm-hmm. go against uh, your, naked your pal- Palpatine. Your Palpatine. Because uh, I think she thinks she's going to win. She's still innocent. (laughs) (laughs) But I want to be beat me before you do. I think that's her. her, That's her her goal. Yes. She really wants to beat you before beat 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 the uh, the Palpatine deck before before anyone else. That's kind of her goal. And uh, it is undefeated. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh-huh. I have a deck to play it. Uh huh. We haven't um, we haven't put it to the test yet. Mm-hmm. And uh, she doesn't like the deck. I've played her several yeah, times. Yeah, I've heard it. about. It. <laughs> and she gets very mad. Yeah, very angry. Mm-hmm. And um, the Star Wars Destiny woes. The the, the anger is real. Um, mm. But uh, yeah, it it. I think it's a solid deck mm. that I think will play well against your Palpatine and hopefully win. Maybe, Maybe. you can dream. I I, I can dream. Mm-hmm. Um, I played her at Destiny today. Yeah, how did uh, it go? And uh, I beat her, and she was mad. And uh, yeah, I told her I was like, I, and I told her I was like, I she got mad the last two times I played these this deck because uh-huh. it's a frustrating deck. Yeah, but I d- made it intentionally mean because yeah. I'm trying to beat naked pout with it. Yeah, <laughs> and she just my guinea pig. Uh-huh. <laughs> unfortunately. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Uh, uh-huh. And <laughs> is that like a pet name? No, my little guinea pig. <laughs> no, no, not at all. <laughs> not at all. Uh, she just, you know, she gets to. She, I play more with her than anybody else, so I, she gets to to try to the be uh-huh. the person I try decks on, uh-huh. and um, mm-hmm. to her uh, dissatisfaction. <laughs> okay. But anyway, she I beat uh, beat her and. Um, um, I also played Gary with the same deck earlier this week. Yeah. And uh, we were both playing very similar decks. Yeah. Which I took inspiration from his this deck. I played it last week. Mm-hmm. And so it was a... I, I, when I, I took inspiration from it to build this new deck. And it was a... It was a weird game. <laughs> it went really weird. Yeah. Because we were both had the same strategy, and they both built around speed. Uh-huh. And he was when he was having a little trouble playing the deck because he he's used to going first. Mm-hmm. And he wasn't going first. And he wasn't going first because I had made a deck that was just as fast, uh-huh. if not faster. Mm-hmm. And so I had the edge to keep beating, mm-hmm. getting first uh, turn every mm-hmm. time. And he was like, it's, it's weird playing this deck. And not going first. Not going first. Yeah. And uh, I'm like, curious how they they hold up against uh, Naked Pal because he is fast. And yeah. He's only one character, so mm-hmm. it's not like I even have like you know y'all still have two characters, therefore you still have a uh, handful of dice to go. Potentially, so. this deck can be very fast. Yeah. It just depends sometimes on the card combination. Yeah. There there's some combos where it, it, this deck I have done four cards in a round. Yeah. I, so lots we, of ambush. I get have tons of ambush mm-hmm. in it, and it I've I've just like bam bam bam. I can stack them and just run in a row mm-hmm. and do a, like a whole bunch of stuff. And I can like roll and and uh and resolve dice all that really quickly. Yeah. So we'll see. We'll see. We'll see. I also we'll have some to... uh, uh some some planetary uprising cards in there, yeah. which are the the cards that make mm-hmm. my girlfriend very angry. Mm-hmm. That yeah, deal. because they, that's the one that deals damage every time you claim. Every time you claim, right? it deals two uh, mm-hmm. indirect damage, mm-hmm. and uh, I've used it every time I played her with the deck. That's what's defeated her. Mm-hmm. I I get, as soon as she gets close enough to dying, I just claim and and she dies. Mm-hmm. She gets very mad every time I do it. Yes, calls I've heard. Me, I've heard. Calls, the, uh... calls me some mean words, <laughs> but it's okay. Uh huh. It's okay. I mean, they were accurate words. But yes, <laughs> that's why it's okay. Um, um, but 
uh, she and I are in agreement about one thing. I'm very proud of you right now. Uh huh. You said she and I. Uh huh. Priority. Uh-huh. I oh. told you, I do it by priority. <laughs> <laughs> if I was saying, uh, if I was talking about people noticed, us, I would say me and Dave. I try not to do it too much on the show, but Dudley says me and me and Trey, <laughs> me and Rob, me and you know, me and Max. It's always me and the, and it, it drives me nuts. I'm always correcting you, and I try not to do it too much on the show. But I'm sure people have heard me correct you on the show. Uh, it, it's called priorities. <laughs> okay, so she's the only one you say before. Well, I have to. Uh-huh. <laughs> <laughs> um, uh, <laughs> uh-huh. Oh man, we're talking about her a lot this week. She's uh-huh. gonna. Uh, so uh, we'll, we'll see how that goes. <laughs> um, but anyway, she agrees with me that it is total bullshit that you are playing a double dice Palpatine without owning both dice, and that we call that bullshit. Um, that you we this agree is the deck she that she wanted you to should... play against. Huh? She wants to play against it. Yes, oh, I but guess I can't play saying, you then. No, what we're saying is you need to fork out the money and buy the dice. Um, I, you know, I, I, you can't, you can't demand to play me. I'm just, not, I'm not. She's not demanding. I can't she's play just that saying day. it's kind of it's bullshit. And I'm like, yes, I agree. <laughs> is it, uh, huh? You and I are on the same page uh-huh. about this. And uh, I've been thinking about buying some more. I just, yeah. uh, I've been waiting off because I've been waiting for the draft. Yeah. We're hopefully, hopefully, we'll hopefully do doing a draft. Week, we were supposed to do it this week, but we were supposed you know, to do it two weeks. Johnny ago. Johnny D has had, you know, stuff he had to do, so he hadn't been like, able to attend. You know. Whatever. Fix his house or something, you know, whatever. <laughs> he uh, doesn't need a house. Yeah, who he needs just a needs house? his cars. <laughs> uh, so <laughs> we've been, we've had to delay it some. So hopefully, I'm hoping this week we do the draft. Yeah, at least get the draft so we can get the card. Yes, yeah, so um, we can see what we're working with. See what we're see how, so we can start building decks. Uh, and then uh, I need we'll another shot. It. I've uh-huh. come close to. I've come second in both uh-huh. last two tournaments, uh-huh. and I really. <sighs> I just need to uh-huh. need one more. I uh-huh. just need to need to win. Also, I want more cards. Mm-hmm. I've been really ur- ur- urging to uh, urging. I don't know. <laughs> Is that the right word? Itching. Urging. I like urging. Urge. I, I felt the need. I... <laughs> it's urgency. I... Oh, okay. but <laughs> I I really a feel sense of urgency. I, I feel the urgent. Uh huh. That you gotta the, stop the butchering urge. English language. <laughs> I feel it. Uh huh. I, I want more cards. It's called edging. <laughs> <laughs> don't Google that. <laughs> Just so you know, you don't want to know. If you don't already know, don't. Oh, I'm I'm familiar. With it. <laughs> uh, I'm sure ever, everyone is. Okay. There uh, should be really. <laughs> Oh, uh, if you had one an experience. Uh, uh, anyway, moving on. <laughs> anyway, uh, we, since I want we didn't cards. do the draft, we, and I honestly, I completely forgot I was writing notes on other stuff I played with, and I completely forgot about meeting with Gary this week. Yeah, and we played some playing games. a new game called, what was it, Tiny At- Epic Kingdom? Uh, is it is tiny? What, I just thought it was Epic Kingdom. I think it's Tiny Epic Kingdom. It may be tiny. Maybe, I don't know. I just thought it was called Epic Kingdom. I think it's called Tiny, Ep- tiny Epic Kingdom. Yeah. Okay. It's, uh, it's a cool little game. It's a cool little, little, like a little small box worker placement. Kind of worker placement. It is it kind of, pretty much kind a worker of, placement. Well, so it's, it's like a shared worker placement thing. Yeah. Because you don't have your own workers. You have a, a, a group pile of shields, yes. and, and then once and you use them all, action, they yeah. reset. And everyone gets actions every time yeah. you play it. So it's a little bit different than a normal It's a little rec. different because everyone gets to benefit from the action. Yeah. Um, but... Uh, it's uh, yeah, it's cool. Everyone got their own little little card Kingdom. with uh with terrain and stuff mm-hmm. like a little map on it. But you can also travel to each other's uh, cards. Kingdoms. And uh, mm-hmm. well, the kingdom is what you're building on them. Well, this yeah, is but the area. I mean, it's the map. It's your kingdom. But uh, and it's really cool. But and there's like a bunch of different races. Yeah, I was playing the undead. Mm-hmm. Uh, Gary the, was the dark elves. Dar- Gary was the dark elves. Which, I was a what, what was you were changelings. Yeah, I, well, I, I would call them my doppelganger, but I think they called them changelings. Oh, I don't remember. Yeah, actually. In the, but, but yeah, uh, it was they, it, which difficult was weird. to play. <laughs> I probably shouldn't have started with. Yeah, that. it's not a good one to start with. I did thing. well. You did fine. Yes. But I kept the whole thing is every time you level up with the 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 every yeah every time you upgraded your magic abilities, I would change. You would change which to race, a race. I was. You would get which, a random. Kept confusing me. Yeah, it made I, it hard to plan ahead. <laughs> it made it, I kept having different goals every time I came yes. to a different race. I see that uh, if you're really good yeah. at the game. Uh, who won? That. 
Uh, no one. I we, don't think we that's decided true. to quit. That's not how it. That's not. It I believe I won. Long. No, uh, I don't remember I, that I, at all. I, <laughs> you, you, just because you chose to forget it. I don't remember. Uh, <laughs> the um, but yeah, it's a cool little game. It was like we were trying to find something different, and he, yeah, Gary got a lot of small, cool small box games. Well, we were really wanting to do the draft, and that didn't work out. Yeah. so we we were just we like were looking at flying and, by the seat of our pants. Yeah, yeah. and yeah. we ended up picking it just because it was something he had. He didn't. It was yeah, never, knew we had new. never played it. I liked it. It was pretty cool. I liked it. Um, though I have a few. Things on it like Gary's Dark Elves, yeah. are a little broken in my opinion. I, potentially, unless I think, we were just I think misunderstood it, it, the rule, the rule, the way it is. But the way he, according to his deal, once he was in the forest, you couldn't attack him there. Yeah, I mean, I think there are ways around it. Yeah, like, and, well, one is that I think the real trick is to make to make try basically keep him from getting into them. Yeah, like uh, one way to counteract it is just move into the forest before he does. But also, I think the other way around it is if you share, you were like you were sharing a scar yeah. ally. Yeah, and if I had realized it, I wouldn't have done yeah. it. Yeah, and yeah. Uh, but I think in theory, if you had gone to war with him in another space, you could push him out of there. Okay, I think that you was can't it. directly. I yeah, I could, you couldn't directly attack him there, but by going to war with him, you could even bump of course, him. Basically, this was the first edition of the yeah. game, and apparently there was a second edition, yeah, so they, it might be tweet. clearer in the, yeah, they in the new. I think they set. updated some of the rules because there so, was some part that was a little ambiguous. Yeah, and but I think I, I see the potential. Just our yeah. first edition, but it's a cool little game because it, it's it's real kind small. Of a com- it's real small. It comes, it's a small box game. And it has some of the complexities of a worker placement and a little bit of strategy, kind of making war with each other game. Mm-hmm. But it's all really on these small cards mm-hmm. and real simple, and it's like easy to just bust out. And, yeah. You know, and well, and the, it's an interesting mechanic, too, because you're picking actions. Yes. And you, you do the action, but everyone else does the action as well. Yeah, or so, they could do the action, or they could just gather resources based on the location that they inhabit. Yeah. And get and resources. So the whole thing is just managing, you're like, I want to do this, yes. but uh, you want to make sure it doesn't benefit other yes. people doing the same action. Yeah. While so you're also kinda... trying to get build up resources, which is what you use to, yeah. to upgrade your 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 stuff, build more more level up, more build more units, and um, and also uh, go to war. Like it's yeah. resources, it's all the same stuff. You mm-hmm. just spend it a certain yeah. way. It's really cool. I really it's like good. It. I like it's I said, I was kind of, I was a little uncertain about it because the box art was kind of oh, okay. Yeah, but it's really cool. I liked it. I'd yeah. like to try it again. Sometime. I'd like to try it again. Maybe if we can get a the, uh, an updated rule set. Yeah, for or it. or a fourth play, and, and then have four players a little more. clearer. I don't know how many it played up to. I don't. I think it had six. a bunch. Yeah, it had a bunch of. Uh, I think it's two to six different races, but but I'm not 100 percent sure yeah, on that. It was yeah, really you, cool. You, you had to look it up. Very simple. I think oh. it's like a twenty buck game. So yeah, it's it's, it's not an yeah. expensive so. one. But uh, hopefully we do the draft this week and we won't be not playing some random tiny kingdom game. I don't know. No, I'm fine, fine with it. I was fine too. There, w- there are some other games mm-hmm. Gary has I wouldn't mind playing. Yeah, we may have to just bring some of ours next time. Just yeah, to... I know. Uh, yeah, I need to. I know I keep bringing it up, but at some point we need to sit down and go through the Dark Souls. Uh, yeah, board game. We played it once, kind of, but we were kind of didn't fully understand the rules. And I have since like slept a lot, so I don't remember. Yeah. I need to relearn. Also, I haven't played it. Next so. month I have more expansions coming from the Kickstarter. Oh, okay. They start being shipped. Uh, out. I think next month or the month after. I think mm. it's June. Nice. Uh, so I will be getting more expansions to a game where we have not really played. Yeah. But uh, we need to give it a go. No yawning. Stop I'm, it. I'm, it's late. <laughs> you, you made us do the show Last late. Last time it was early and you were yawning. No, I wanted. That was because it was after nap time, <laughs> and that was two weeks ago. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh yeah. So mm-hmm. yeah, it, it's good. It's yeah. good. Um. What did you play? Anything else? I have played a couple of things. Yeah. I I I have finished building most of the parts of the in uh, Nintendo Labo. Oh yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. I had built the uh, the fishing one, mm-hmm. and I had built the little house, which I honestly didn't fully discover all the uses of it until today. Oh really? Because like you know, I I said I think I said on the show that I was like, I know there's more to it because I've seen videos of more yeah. stuff, but I hadn't figured out how the hell you do it. Mm-hmm. And it, it's, and it's, it made, one time, I was showing it off to, uh, to my lady friend, mm-hmm. and, uh, I was showing her all the different stuff, and, uh, she, I, I was showing it to her, and then I realized, 
I never once plugged in two but two switch interact because it's got all these little buttons and levers you could attach to the uh, house. I never once plugged two of them together at the same time. Uh, I always did one thing at a time, and when I did that, it goes to a little mini game. Like every combination in every slot is with a mini every, game. Yeah, is a little mini game, side mini game. Hmm. So there's like a minecart one where you you turn the lever, it starts and let it go, and it starts a little propeller and it pulls the minecart, and you're hitting the button to jump it, and you're trying to get these gems. Hmm. And then like each game, if you do it, if you do it 100, percent you get a little like candy. It, you all, all of it gives you rewards of food you can feed your little, little creature, little guy. And when you feed them different stuff, it changes them. So, like his skin color changes. He'll get. Uh, you, if, if you do it 100, percent each one gives you like a little hard candy mm. that gives him a a paint a spot skin design. Like the first one I got was like a skull, mm. and it looked kind of cool. Uh, and so, and then there's like a little room you can go into, and you can swap them out as you unlock them. You can store them there. But then there's like there's a bunch of different ones. Uh, there's there's like a little shooting gallery one. Hmm. There's like one where he's flying up on a on a a balloon and you're dodging spike bomb things and and there's a bunch of different ones. And I was like, why didn't I try this? <laughs> it yeah. never occurred to me to try. Uh, though I did. One of the things I found is funny is you you can put the button on and flip the switch to turn the light off and turn it to night, and mm-hmm. then you can play the little you can do the little cranking wheel one and it has a little uh, what do you call it a mobile mm-hmm. uh, yeah that's and, it. And, it, and it puts him asleep. Well, if you sit there while he's sleeping, all these creepy things happen. <laughs> like the the picture on the wall is a guy some dude on the wall and his guys glow and hmm. stuff comes out of things. It's kind of creepy. It's hmm. just like, holy shit. Uh, your place is haunted. <laughs> but, uh, yeah. but yeah, I figured that out. I'm like, oh shit, there's all this stuff. Yeah, and I know there's another attachment that's like a cable and it's like two plugs and you can like, I guess plug it into someone else's house. I'm not really sure yet because I've only glanced at it, but there's Did tons you try of little... plugging in two different I parts? haven't made it yet because I... I I didn't. I thought I. I was thinking I might need another house, someone else with a set to try it out, but mm. I'm not sure. Mm. Uh, but mm. I also built the motorcycle one. Yeah. Which I have to admit I was a little underwhelmed by. Yeah. Because, I mean, it was okay. I think it, it's complicated to make, and then, uh, it works fairly well. Though it didn't mess up on me. Like I couldn't get it to turn anymore. I don't know if my controller went mm-hmm. dead or something. But um, but it's cool. It's kind of like a slow Mario Kart. And step on motorcycles, and you're mm-hmm. steering it. Uh, I felt at first when I first was playing it, I, I had trouble like turning the mm-hmm. the, the uh, throttle, the throttle, and holding it and get it. But it uh, when I was playing it earlier today, it well, didn't seem to be. Uh, you just not used to riding a motorcycle. I guess that's how it works. You gotta. But it's cool it. because you you got a little button you press to start the ignition before mm-hmm. the race, and then you got a little brake paddle, and eh, it's kind of cool. Mm-hmm. But hands down, the best one mm-hmm. is the piano. The piano is really the cool. The piano is amazing. Yeah. And the way it works is really clever. And uh, it's got all kinds of little things you can plug into it and different mm-hmm. stuff. And uh, my girlfriend fell in love with it because you can plug in little knobs. On the basic piano game, you can plug in a little knob and it changes what kind of sounds the, the yeah. notes are. But you have the basic piano one. And you plug one in it's like chorus people singing. And then one of them's like a dad singing. Mm-hmm. It's like out of tune it's, funny. <laughs> it's like hur, hur, hur. it's really silly it's like and they all it looks like the choir people but he's got like a little mustache and like a uh, uh balding <laughs> and it's really silly but uh but her favorite one is the you can make it they all sound like cats yeah it's like meowing cats yeah and she loves it she thinks it's the best thing ever she she was just like i steal this she was talking about stealing it because she <laughs> wanted it so well bad. she had to steal your tw- switch I, so I told to her i was like yeah yeah you're gonna pay me for the switch uh, so I played around with it, but I also played around with the st- there's a studio mode, mm-hmm. which gives you like like five octaves, yeah, uh, and, and and you can record on five different sets, or you can record and and make different sets of uh, notes, and so you can actually like produce music in it. Yeah, I don't know if there's any way to get it off of there, but it's really cool, <laughs> and I was kind of dicking around with it but not doing a very good job but it came out all right there is a drum track thing 
Like mm-hmm. you have a little punch card, I think, that goes in. You have to. I don't really know how you're supposed to punch it out and keep it punched out, or not if you don't want to unpunch it. I don't know. But it has a punch card stuff you can push into it, and it'll change the wavelengths. It'll do different things. Mm. And there's just tons of little bits and bobs on it, and it, it's really cool. Yeah, and you I were really, playing with it. The other, yeah, yeah, I guess it was a lot. Maybe last night or yeah. night before. It is pretty pretty yeah. cool. And it's were, pretty fantastic. It's, yeah. Like it's so bizarre because I'm sitting there playing on a, a cardboard piano that's already set up to like record music and stuff. It's cool. Yeah, I really want to. I want to try the robot one, yes. but uh, eighty bucks is a lot. I don't of know. Money. It might be really cool. It might. It probably would be, but I, it seemed like it would take a while to build. Maybe. I mean, it took a. It takes it's a while. Got, got a lot of moving parts. To yeah. It. I mean, mm-hmm. I was working on the piano like for the better part of a whole movie. Like yeah yeah, yeah for we like watching almost mo- two hours you were... yeah I was sitting there kind of one half watching the movie and working on it and, yeah and I had started on it before the movie started so mm-hmm. like it took it took a while yeah. it, like some of the other one took like an hour or so mm-hmm. maybe longer two hours to build and it takes a while you didn't think it would but it it takes a little bit of time hmm. it's a lot of pieces and you know making mm-hmm. sure you assemble it right but oh, it's cool yeah it's real cool. Hmm. I like it. It's fantastic. Well, I may be tempted to get the. Uh, I will robot. tempt you further to do it to do so. Uh, money, yeah. money, money, money. Uh-huh. I have I have too many hobbies. Uh-huh. Too many things to spend yes, money on. Yes, yes, yes. And uh, but yeah, have you been playing anything else? I played some Stardew Valley. Oh yeah, mm-hmm. yeah. I saw you playing it. Yeah, uh, uh, not a lot, just a little bit. How's, how's I, that I, going I'll play a day and then I'll, I'll come back, and it's yeah. fine. Yeah, it's, 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 it's a great game. Old man is doing great. <laughs> doing just fine. Uh-huh. Uh, uh, speaking of other... Uh, speak, uh, this has nothing to do with what I was just talking about. Uh-huh. I just trying speaking to of nothing else. Speaking uh, of nothing What about what I'm saying. Uh, uh, we are really close to getting a diplomacy game going. Yes, we are. I had that in my notes. That we are almost ready to start. The only... We're really... The holdup is, I think, Trey is the only one who hasn't confirmed. Me. And I haven't you. confirmed yet, either. Yeah, but, just but because, once y'all two confirm, we can well, go... The website wouldn't load when I was at work, and yeah, and I, it went down for a second yeah. there. Like it was kind of busted for a bit, but then yeah. it came back up fine. Yeah, and so I wasn't able to get onto it mm. Friday, and then so yeah. tomorrow I'll I'll, I'll confirm, yeah. and we'll we'll hopefully start. I the hope game. everyone else is as enthusiastic as I am about playing. Because I I, I, so I sent out a group text to everyone that's in the game, and nobody responded. <laughs> yeah, they're all like. Okay. 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 I guess they're all busy. I don't know. They're all adults. Mm-hmm. Or but something. Something like that. Yeah. Uh, so, so, yeah, hopefully we start that soon. I don't yeah. want to harass, probably going to harass Trey to get get him, get him his confirmation yeah. in, and so we can start, get, yeah. the, get the stuff rolling. Yeah. Uh, I'm wow. excited. It should be fun, because it, it's, it's, it's a cool reason to talk to a bunch of people we haven't yeah, talked to Yeah, that we don't talk to all the time, but... Yeah. It'll and be fun. A bunch of our friends. Yeah. And, and we'll, uh, we'll bring out, bring back war reports. Yes. And, and Every, we'll, we'll be uh, posting, and I'll probably put it on uh, Twitter as well, mm. uh, updates and after every turn and how things yeah. are progressing. Yeah. And uh, But uh, we'll we'll let you all know next week if it's mm. up and going. Yeah. Uh, or you can keep an eye on us on Twitter. We'll yeah. we'll post on yeah. there when, when it's up. Mm-hmm. And uh, we'll let you know. Mm-hmm. The war is coming. Yeah. <laughs> it's coming. <laughs> Um, I played, I continued to play Minute. Yes. Uh, I finished it. Yeah? Did uh, it take a minute? It took four hours. <laughs> uh, that's, that's but minutes. it does have a new game plus. Oh. Which is what, 30 seconds? 40 seconds. Oh, I was just joking. I didn't know. No, that's no, it, 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 you only have 40 seconds and you only get one heart. And, and even, even when you get up, how many do you have normally? Normally, I think you start with three, and then you get you unlock more as you play. Oh, uh, but uh, yeah, you um, in New Game Plus, uh, it's a bunch of weird little things. Uh, you only have one heart, so basically, if you get hit, you die. You have forty sec, only forty seconds to run out and do anything, and a lot of stuff been tweaked. Mm-hmm. I'm pretty sure there are items that make things easier that aren't in there. Mm-hmm. Like there's a there's some dark rooms you go into like underground sewers and basements mm-hmm. and stuff that you had to get a lantern to be able to see it in. I don't I haven't found the lantern. I don't <laughs> think it's there in, anymore. Hmm. So I'm having to like figure out the way to get through these dark areas without it. Mm. It's 
really hard. Yeah, it sounds it gets, like it. The game gets really, and they train stuff around so that you you can't just rely on memory. If like mm. apparently they've like manu- changed stuff around, shift, uh, and made it harder. But it's a really cool game. I really like it. Yeah, I, I it's it's just cool looking. The art's fantastic. It's got a cool weird little style, and I really enjoy it. I might just play through it again on normal mode, just because I tried. The new game plus or second run, I think is what they call it, mm-hmm. and I didn't get very far. Yeah. I, got, I got stuck. And you're not like, very good. Ugh. You're so you're used to that sixty second run time. Well, it's less about time frames; it's more about the other lim- the thing they've done to make it harder as well. I'm just like, yeah. oh, I I I don't know how to get through this without <laughs> the, the thing that I had, I, the safety net I had built for myself. Yeah, I don't know, but oh, it's such a cool game. You need to play it. You need I, to check I it do. out. Like I said, it's not a long game. Yeah, uh, but. Yeah, it's, it's What are great. you playing it on? PC. PC. Mm-hmm. It's on Steam, so I can just play it. Yeah, yours. it's on Steam. So okay. you can you can try out my copy. All right. Uh, I will get on that. It's on consoles as well. I don't I don't think it's not on on the Switch. It sounds like a good game would be on It would be a cool game to have on the Switch, but uh, if it had been on there, I might I might have considered it. I don't think it was on the Switch. Yeah. Let me double check hmm. that. Well, all right. We are going to have some dead air by the end of just typing into the Googles. Yes. Uh, what does the Googles tell us? It says it's going to. It's coming to the Switch. It sounds like a good game to be on the Switch. Yeah. Um. But yeah. Yes. All right. Well, uh, did you play anything? heading to the Switch this year? Okay. This was an article from three days ago. All right. So. Uh, did you uh have any other games you want to talk about? Uh, let's see. I don't believe I played anything else. I've been playing a shit ton of um. Uh, Cartoon Network Matchland. Uh huh. I play that constantly. I like that game. Okay. And it frustrates me sometimes because mostly because I'm like do 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 do, and then I fuck up. I mess up the swipes or the, yeah. the shift around, and or I, I it you're goes playing, the wrong way. You're playing Candy Crush. Uh huh. It whatever. <laughs> uh, you're just it, playing Candy Crush. It's awesome. I like it. It's uh-huh. a cool game, and uh-huh. it's got characters I like. Uh-huh. Uh huh. That and chess. I play mm. a lot of chess. With yeah, I do you. play that with you. And I'm back up. I'm doing well. I I there was a rough patch for a while where I was losing all the games I was playing because mm-hmm. I was busy. I was traveling a lot. Excuses. I was in a lot of training. Excuses. So I, I was doing really terrible. Excuses. But you're just a terrible player. Uh, <laughs> Yeah, what's our what's our current score? I don't know. I don't keep up I, with I, it. I know what it is. Okay, whatever. I I believe it's nineteen to six. I, whatever. It don't I, matter. Yeah, it doesn't matter. The only you thing that matters is the current game. <laughs> <laughs> How's that yeah. going for you? I think it's going okay. I don't, I don't remember. I, I'm not really. I'm sure playing either. three games right now. I don't remember. I'm, I've I always, I'm always playing. Three I forget games. which one which until I look at. It. I'm doing well against Trey. I think. Yeah, I'm up on Trey, which is first. It's been that a while since I'm actually. Uh, uh, one win ahead of him right yeah. now, but I might lose this one. I'm on. Yeah, it 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 was weird. It started off weird. It got weird, and then I got to a point where it's like I'm not really sure. We were all kind of mangled up and like yeah, he does. We had that. our we had our our kind of our like battle lines drawn, and we were all just like waiting to see who was gonna make the first. Yeah, one. me and, and him have similar play yeah. style, so it kind of gets really complicated. Yeah, yeah. Um, but it's fun. It's, it's fun. Doing good. All right, let's talk about news. News. Sure. The big one I want to talk about first is, sure. is a big one. Mm. Uh, Nintendo Online. Yeah, I, I was trying to find this information on it, and I couldn't. I have it. Go, I, 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 I didn't really look that hard, but yeah. I just assumed you had it. And I, I do. Went on with my life. Uh, Nintendo Online is coming in September. Okay. Um, and they've announced prices, okay. which are pretty good. Yeah. Uh, if for one month is four dollars. One four. month is four dollars. One month, okay. More, more. Four dollars. Yes, for it's four dollars. Four dollars. And three months is eight dollars. Okay. Uh, a year is twenty. That's really good. Which is insanely good. It's cons- really considering cheap. a year of like PlayStation Plus is sixty dollars. Yeah. Uh, which is still not that bad. It's you not break bad it at down. All. That's yeah. You know, like five dollars yeah. a month. But uh, that's not bad. But yeah. the twenty dollars is pretty good. Yeah, I would do now, that. Now here's the interesting one. That's the interesting they have a family pack. Yeah. So it's a yearly family pack. Okay. Is thirty five dollars, 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 thirty five dollars, uh-huh. and it lets you have eight people on the same plan. How does that work? I have no idea. And what's the benefit <laughs> of doing that? Like, I mean, I, I guess other than the splitting thirty five dollars eight ways. Yeah. <laughs> well, I mean, I guess the idea is that if you have a family, and I mean, it makes all... sense. I mean, Nintendo's always catered for for yeah. Uh, 
you know, younger people and, and, yeah. and kids and stuff. So it seems I like assume it's a way to like parents, so parents can pay that one price and the, all their, their family, all play. their family and yeah. kids can all be on the same. I think me, you, and all our other people who play Switch. Like our group of friends, <laughs> and, all the, everyone we know who has a Switch can just get a plan I, together. I know there's four of us off the top of my head, <laughs> so we could split. It's that. twenty bucks. I know, but it, it would only be you know nine dollars. Yes, it's not, no, no, that's four, not right. Thirty-five divided It'd by be like four eight dollars. It's like eight dollars. Yeah, a person. Yeah, eight, that's eight pretty good. <laughs> pretty good. Uh, pretty good. Yeah, for a but year. it's twenty bucks. I mean, come on. Uh, yeah, I mean, it's really that. I'm matter. fine I'll with probably playing twenty, 20 bucks anyway. But some of the features are pretty good. Yeah. So it'll have a cloud save, so you can back up your save games. Um and what what are you doing? <laughs> I'm I'm mocking you that you have your yeah, nose resting I rest on it. Yeah, rest my nose on it. Yeah, the... it looks weird. Yeah, okay. okay. <laughs> um. Anyway. <laughs> um. <laughs> um. But yeah, and what's also included is some uh offline NES games. Okay. And they have a list. Of, I got a list of the games that are coming. Okay. That'll be available. Lay it on me. Lay it on me. Uh, we got Ice Climbers. Okay. Legend of Zelda. Balloon Fight. Legend of Zelda, like the, the first one? NES. Any, these are all NES games. Okay. Uh, soccer, tennis, Mario Bros, Super Mario Bros, Dr. Mario, Super Mario Bros. Dr. Mario? 3. I haven't played Dr. Uh-huh. Mario in so long. And Donkey Kong. Wait, you say Super Mario 3? Yes. Woo! Yeah, they Those skipped are all two. Good games. They just jumped to so three. So are going to give all of them? Huh? We're going to have access to all of mm-hmm. them? When you play, you'll have access to them. Oh. And you don't have to be online to play them, but it's interesting. You can. T- Apparently, people can watch you play them. Yeah, like, and and I think that's the case for a lot of them. I'm not sure if it's all for all of them, but the, for for those games, people can watch you play. Mm-hmm. So it's kind of and then also there's apparently a pass controller feature. Yeah. So you can just be like, you'll both be playing. One of you be playing, and you're like, oh, I, I and you can pass it over to the other. I gotta person. go to the restroom. Yeah, playing? and the other person will take over your game like from another switch. That's weird. Which that's sound, a weird feature, but okay. It sounds weird. It sounds weird, but it it all sounds cool to use. Like I mean, it sounds like old school. Like, yeah. It's oh, like, it's my turn to play. And, yeah. You know, whatever. Yeah. It's, it's weird. It's really cool, but interesting. I, yeah, I, I I'm curious to try I'm it out. To see how it works, but um, I mean, I pay twenty bucks a year just for the the classic games to yeah. be able to play them. Yeah, that's cool. Um, and there's some other little features to it, but those were the things I, I that grabbed my attention. Mm-hmm. Um, but thirty or uh, twenty dollars isn't really good price. Yeah, it's not I mean, bad. insanely. I mean, it's like a third of what Nintendo and I mean, what the uh, PlayStation and uh-huh. and uh, uh, Xbox <coughs> is doing. Yeah, so that's cool. Um, it's apparently just ever. I get the Nintendo Minis are just you know started a craze. Mm-hmm. So now there's going to be a Neo Geo Mini. Yeah, it's going to have forty uh, forty games on it. Okay. Which is more than the Nintendo one, so that's not bad. Yeah. But they haven't said what they're gonna be. Mm-hmm. Um, I assume it'll be like kind of like the collection that you can see yeah. on the Switch store and yeah. stuff. It'll just be in a little mini arcade. Yeah. It looks pretty kind of neat. Yeah. I kind of like the little uh-huh. arcade setup thing. Oh, it's there a you go. Mini. If you like a little mini, like it'd be look like it'd be pretty good. Just to have like a hummer on your desk. Yeah. Like so you can be unproductive. Mm-hmm. <laughs> like I'm just gonna play this little fighting game here mm-hmm. for a little bit. Uh-huh. Uh So so that's kind of cool. If you're into that, mm-hmm. maybe. maybe. Um, uh, there's a new. They've announced a new table charging stand for Switch. Oh yeah. So like it's a little little deal that you can set on the table and it your Switch will sit on it. So it's yeah. kind of like a it's a like a kickstand kind of yeah. thing. But it also charge your Switch while yeah, you're plugged into it. It's kind of a you can't really use the kickstand on the back of the uh, the Switch and charge it. Yeah, exactly. And this which I mean, I I get it. Why don't you just plug into the dock or whatever? I never used the kickstand on it. Yeah, I have. So, I used it a little bit when I was building stuff in the Nintendo Labo. That makes sense. But um, and even then, it got to where I just laid it flat because I knocked it over once. And like, yeah, yeah, that's fine. It's not the the kickstand is not the best. It's not the feature. best, but it's not terrible. Um, but they're gonna they're coming out with a little you know so you can have it on, a, yeah. on the table. Mm-hmm. Um, it's twenty dollars. Mm-hmm. Comes out June thirteenth, I think. So that's cool. Mm-hmm. If, you, if you play on the table a lot or your desk or something, mm-hmm. and you want to set it down, mm-hmm. which I don't understand, I lay in bed and play. So. Yeah, I know. I, I I play it portable. 
mode pretty, pretty much, much all the time. always. Yeah. Uh, I don't I, even really. I don't even think my dock station is even hooked up right now. I think mine I is. I just it just plugged. Yeah. I just charged on it. Yeah. Um. Uh, yeah. So yeah, it's cool. Um. Let's see. The there's a new Arkham. Uh, not Arkham. A new Batman the anime series board game coming. Yeah, I saw something about it's that. It's from the guy who made uh, Arkham Horror, so I'm sure okay. Gary's going to be very interested. Yeah. Um, it sounds kind of similar to Arkham Horror, yeah. where you play you play as bat- ca- badminton characters, uh-uh. and you go through like events little, yeah. that are apparently based on little stories that are based on the first season of the show, and then they'll okay. have expansion, I assume, will be other seasons. Um, kind of like the Arkham Horror, yeah. you know, That's RPG cool. element. Yeah, no. I saw it, and I just, I, it was one of the things I saw, I'm like, oh, I need to look and see what that's all about. I, I saw a couple it looks pictures, pretty, it looks interesting. and then forgot about it. <laughs> it looks good. Um, it comes out in August, so okay. if you're a fan of the Batman animated series, and which you like we board are, games. Yeah. and you should be too, Yeah, uh, uh, comes out in August, and it's $50, uh-huh. probably. It's Somewhere a Kickstarter, right? Yeah. Huh? Is it Kickstarter? Or no. I no. thought it was a Kickstarter. I don't think so. I could have sworn it was a Kickstarter. I don't think not. so. Maybe I not. never saw anything about Kickstarter. Maybe I'm just a crazy person. Um, but, yeah. Uh, let's see. Um, we talked about the book the, about the history of EVE Online, the mm-hmm. Empire of EVE. Yeah. It came out a, a while ago. Um, mm-hmm. But the guy who wrote in, his kick, did a Kickstarter. It's already ended, unfortunately. But did a Kickstarter for... Uh, um, a volume two, yeah. So it's continuing uh, the history of Eve Online, yeah. Which I need to read the first book. It sounds interesting because yeah, there's be cool. a lot of interesting history on Eve mm-hmm. um, that would be pretty cool to read about. Yeah. Um, so if you're interested, in that, the second book is well. It's already in, his starter ended last week. That's when I found out about it today. Yeah. <laughs> so I missed it completely. Yeah. But. It, if it's like anything like the first one, you can still buy it. Yeah. Like you can go on their website and buy the first book, mm-hmm. uh, which I may do at some point. Just yeah. I may just get the Kindle version because it's only yeah. ten dollars. There you go. Um, the hard hard copy is like fifty. I was like, mm-hmm. um, but anyway, uh, Destiny Two did something interesting. Did they? Um, they had an <laughs> in-game puzzle that okay. eventually. Led to a real world reward. Okay. So there was a puzzle, and then once they did it, it was like a, a bunch of people on Reddit finally did it or mm-hmm. worked it out, and it gave coordinates in upstate New York. <laughs> and one of the guys was like, yeah, I don't live that far from here, and mm-hmm. went over there, and there was a tube. Um, and it's like a what, a, what's in it? <laughs> uh, some gold coins. Like real I gold? don't think it's real gold, but like chocolate gold. Coins. I have no idea. <laughs> Probably just some like to represent like, like where melt in the game. Is warm. <laughs> and uh, and then a spear, a spear of spear. Whoa! Which is pretty cool looking. It's this black spear thing, and apparently there's only three in existence. Whoa! So the guy who ended up with it has one of three spears. He says one and two of them, one of them's owned by one company and the other one's owned by Bungie. So uh-huh. and that guy has the third. So huh. I was like because he was like, Oh I'm near there. Yeah. So uh, that's kinda interesting. Yeah, kind of. And it doesn't really do much for us. No. Or, I, it was like, Oh, that's cool. It's, I was it's never no, going to be anywhere near that. <laughs> I think it's more of like a community thing because yeah. they kind of had to have a community to yeah. To but build it's, it's a but community thing, but only one guy got it. Got the spear, yeah, and, exactly. Yeah, I get. And the note says only take one coin, so I guess the idea is that the first person get there gets the spear and a coin, yeah. and after that, any anyone else who shows up uh-huh. gets a coin. Uh-huh. Um, that guy's a dick. He took all of them. Yeah, he might have. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, he had to go. Go on Reddit and track them down and see what see how many coins he uh-huh. has. <laughs> uh, so who knows? Mm-hmm. Um, so we we saw Infinity Wars. Yes, we seen it twice. Seen it twice. Yeah, it has Thanos. Yes, uh, the villain. Yes, the villain. The villain. The main character. The main character. He really is the main the character. The protagonist. Yes. Well, anyway, protagonist. He also shows up in Fortnite. Yeah. They have an event going. Yeah. Which apparently. I read it. It sounds really good. 
Is it? Yeah. It just seemed really silly to me. Well, it's it. I don't know if it's a, the game mode. Apparently, is a limited thing, and, the, and oh, okay. I've read ar- articles saying that they should leave it in there because it's pretty good. Uh-huh. So the whole thing is, you can only play by yourself. You can't play in a group or whatever. Mm-hmm. Um, it's solo mode only, and then you you're all you know standard battle royale. But then a meteor crashes, mm-hmm. which there's a meteor thing in the game. Yeah, anyways, there's like a, yeah. This one crashes as the uh, Infinity Gauntlet. Okay. And so when you get it, you become Thanos. Okay. And you have a bunch of powers, and the whole thing is everyone else is trying to kill you. <laughs> well, and so it's this whole thing it's where you, everyone everyone's trying one. to get the gauntlet, and once you get the gauntlet, it's, everyone's trying to kill you, everyone and you're you. trying to, you have all these superpowers, and mm-hmm. you basically just start sliding. Okay, that Apparently, sounds fun. It's, it sounds awesome. Sounds like and a lot of fun. I, from what I've read, it's pretty good. Yeah. And it's a really good game. There's even, there, some people are even saying that they should leave it. Like, in, just leave it, leave in, it in permanently. It should yeah. just be a permanent feature mm-hmm. in the game, which I doubt will happen, but... Yeah, <laughs> it might be a licensing I'm thing. sure it's a, there's a licensing thing to yeah. it, so I, it'd probably be... If they keep it, it won't be Thanos. Yeah. They'll, they'll have to change something else. Maybe. Which there's all, is a mechanic for that already, where the meteor crashing and getting mm-hmm. something special, but mm-hmm. I don't know what that is, because I haven't played it yet. Yeah. Um, I have it. I downloaded it. Yeah. I just haven't played it. <laughs> I need to. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> um, let's see what else we got. Uh, Valve. I got a couple things with Valve. Yeah. Um, they have a new app that's coming out. Yeah. They uh, have a couple of new ones coming yeah, out. Yeah. And one of them lets you stream, live stream to your phone, mm-hmm. like your games. So yeah. You, in theory, can play. Well, you can play. Your Steam games on your phone. Yeah. Which I don't know how well that would work. I don't know. It depends I mean, on the game, I guess. But. Yeah, I'm not really sure. It's like, I was confused by it. I thought it was going to be like, because they have some games that are, there are mobile, mobile versions. I thought yeah. it was just going to be able to play them on your phone. Yeah. Like but download it and play on your phone. I but I understand it, it's, it's, it's like a link box. It's like a, yeah, it literally, like if you're connected to the same Wi-Fi or uh, in the same network... Uh-huh. You will. Uh, you will. I just don't know what stream. use I would have for it. I don't think I would have any use for it. It's other than like if you get an adapter, you have an iPad, and you get an adapter to a TV, <laughs> and then you just play it. Like use it as a Link box instead of you know buying one. Yeah, I mean use you, you can. I, that's the only thing I can think. Of. Uh, yeah, I agree. I'm not really sure. If you're playing, if you have like the Apple TV or something yeah. like that, you can get the app, so you don't yeah. have to like, buy a, a yeah a link. Steam Link Steam Link and. Which, that's cool, I that's guess. That's cool, I but guess, yeah. I don't have any real use for it. I don't really either. Mm. So, mm. yeah. Um, Valve was also in the news. They uh, stripped a developer from their store. Yes. Completely. Yeah. Um, because they were... It's a, the company Acrim... Uh, Acrim? Acrim? A-C-R-A-M? Digital? Mm-hmm. Um, they were... Using well, one guy in the yeah, company. one guy published some uh, one of the designers for uh, yeah. their, some of the games they published. Yeah, he uh, had he, six fake accounts and was posting he reviews was, of yeah, his own he was game, making, because, posting positive reviews of his own game. <clears throat> Apparently, because he got angry about some of the negative reviews of yeah. his game, and then you know threw a hissy fit, threw a fit, <laughs> and then in doing so got. <laughs> His publishers, all their yeah. games. Yeah, well, the developer, yeah, the whole company got taken yeah. off Steam. And he apparently uh, has admitted to it and and, yeah. and has apologized and yeah. sent an email to about all, um, yeah. re- like basically saying, saying don't blame, fault, it, it was wasn't him. them, it was just me. Um, yeah. And so. Yeah, it's kind of a dumb thing to do. It was. And it was just, I really think it, though, is it's a, his valve is like, you know, Using them as an example, mm-hmm. like don't do this. Yeah, <laughs> bam, gone. They, I think they've done similar stuff like this. <clears throat> they have, but and so yeah. they're just they're they're very very uh, yeah. protective of their uh, fan base a little bit. I, yeah, in some ways, yeah. Uh, which is weird because the game, one of the games that it that publisher put out is Steam, mm-hmm. the, the little tr- uh, uh, the railroad game, which yeah. I a couple a few weeks ago we were I talked about. It, I brought it up because I was like, "Oh, that kind of looks cool." Now it's not there. It's not there yeah. anymore. You can't get so, it. So I'm wondering if they'll reinstate it once. They... If if it's not one, maybe if it's not one of his games, yeah. then yeah. it they might bring it back. But yeah. who knows? We'll see. We'll yeah. see how that goes. Um, let's see what else we got. 
Um, do, 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 do. I don't think I have anything else. No, oh, yeah. I think I I was thinking we were short on time, and now I've, I've run through all my stuff. <laughs> oh, I have one more thing. Oh, yeah. I do have one more thing. It's uh, Pokemon Go okay. Fest is returning. Again? It, it went so well last it time. It went so well last time. They decided to do it again, uh-huh. but this time there are going to be three of them. <laughs> Okay, are they trying to spread out some of that it's, Well, no, it's not at the same time. It's like a tour thing. Okay. And uh, I think they've learned, hopefully, yeah, that from... they can't like, get that many people in one well, area trying you know, to all 30,000 people in one place trying one to... One place all trying connect. to connect to the cell tower. Yeah. Not going to work. Nah, probably not. Well, for I understand, they, they, you know, they had some issues with, like, the organization of it because, mm. say, no one's ever really done an convention based around a mobile app before. Yeah. And so they were apparently, the people who organized it were basically used to doing like music festivals. Mm-hmm. So it was kind of set up like a music festival, but mm-hmm. there, it's not It's not really, festival. that's not really what it is. So it's kind of kind of a weird, so yeah. hopefully they're figuring they, out. They're it, it's a new thing. thing. Yeah. So maybe it'll go well. Better. Maybe. Yeah. Yeah. I'm not going to go to it, but you know, whatever. I think there's three of them. Mm-hmm. I think one's in Japan, one's in Chicago, and I can't remember where the third yeah. one. Yeah. Uh, Germany? No, I want to say Germany. I don't know. I could be wrong. Mm. But that it's three different places all spread out. I think in July, somewhere in there. In a uh, future In the date. summer. Yeah. It's during the summer sometime. Mm-hmm. Uh, so, you know, one bit of news I, that came out this week that I was really excited to hear about. Not yeah. really game related. But uh, Rick and Morty has been renewed. Oh, yes. I know. I'm excited. For 70 episodes. 70 episodes. That's Insane. about the season. Insane. Yeah. That's like it, you know, a you crazy know, re- deal. That's, ba- that's syndication is what it is. That's 100 episodes. That oh, it is. A, that okay. gets them to 100 and something episodes. 101 ah. episodes. So that's syndication. I didn't remember. I didn't yeah. put that together. Because they exact, have. That, that would be put them over 100 yeah. episodes. That it? would get them the 100 episodes that they could do syndication. <coughs> mm. uh, and that's what they really want. Yeah. Because they You can make a bunch of money. money to, you make a bunch of money off that stuff. I Especially just... the show popular as Rick and Morty is. Oh, yeah. Uh, so, yeah, that was exciting. When we'll get it, who knows? Yeah. Uh, well, you know. And, and, and they're doing the this tour bus, the, the Rick Mobile mm-hmm. kids going around again. And it's going to be near here, actually, in at the end of May. Yeah, so maybe we we'll may go, have to go we'll, see we'll go them. Check it out. See the giant car that looks yeah. like Rick. Yeah, the world's largest Rick. And okay, <laughs> <laughs> buy some merch. It'll be fine. And I don't know what else is involved with it. Merch, lots it's, of merch. Just, you just, can just, buy some merch. Okay. Yeah, well, I guess we'll it's go traveling for money on. Yeah, stuff I don't need to spend money. Yeah, on. sure. But it'll be fine. It'll, it'll be, be cool. fine. It'll be an experience. Yeah. So, uh, <laughs> yeah. Cool. Hopefully, we'll have the draft this week. Hopefully, we'll get the uh, diplomacy game up and running. Yes. And, and uh, life will the begin. anger will begin. No, I never got angry. Uh, that's a lie. Uh-huh. That's, that's complete. Are you talking about in general? or in, I'm talking about in diplomacy. Uh, I'm sure that's not true. <laughs> I'm pretty, I, I have walked away from more games not angry than most everyone else. Well, I would say I haven't been angry either. That's bullshit. <laughs> well, the, I can. You're say, angry I right can, now. <laughs> I can say things as well. You're like the the Bruce Banner of of gaming. No, you're I'm always not. angry. I don't know what to talk about. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just angry at life. <laughs> <laughs> I have nothing um, to do with board games. <laughs> yeah. Uh, the so yeah, we're gonna hopefully we'll have a draft. Mm-hmm. Fingers crossed. Yes, I want new, maybe new I'll consider cards. purchasing a Palpatine. I want new cards. Uh, new cards. Yeah. Mm. Um, please okay. go to our website at deafanddumb.com that's D-E-A-F-N D-U-M-B dot com mm-hmm. uh, and you that's can find links to everything you can please subscribe to us on uh, iTunes iTunes uh, Stitcher Google Play wherever you want to get us mm-hmm. we're out there on everything mm-hmm. and uh, please rate us and review us mm-hmm. and uh, share you know, us on the yeah. uh, Facebooks yeah and follow us on Twitter, Twitter because we'll be c- posting the diplomacy diplomacy stuff. games and uh, if you've, you've never played diplomacy or you kind of want to get an idea, an idea of what it can be like hopefully you'll get some kind of a taste of it and we'll give you some good stories yeah maybe. hopefully maybe I I may I don't know I don't want I don't want to give away my hand but you know we could share public knowledge uh, tidbits but. Mm-hmm. Um. So yeah, okay, and uh, we'll keep putting out new episodes every week. Mm-hmm. Monday's our day. Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah, I'm very tired. Mm-hmm. 
Thank You're the you one who wanted to do it this late. Well, you know. You chose this. <laughs> you chose it. Thank you very much for listening. I'm Dan May. And I'm Dudley May, and this has been... Deaf and Dumb. Deaf and Dumb. <laughs>